What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Unova Red Walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went through Round 3 and got our butts kicked a lot, and, well, we finally got here to the Pokemon Center, and, well, off-screen, we did a little bit of training. As you probably already noticed, we got ourselves Flash, the Tynamo, and we grew it to level 10. That way, it can learn this move, Bind, which, well, it's... Although it's not that great, it's still a good move to actually have other than Tackle. Uh, other Pokemon grew levels and all that stuff, so now it is time for us to go into Mount Moon and see what kind of wonders it actually has in here. Now, like I said before guys, I will be editing out a lot of these battles right here because, uh, well, these Pokemon battles because not so important. Now, if I do see a Pokemon here that I want, it's gonna get see it's gonna get shown. Okay, so... As I figured, I believe uh, Zubats got switched out for Wubat, so yeah, <laughs> yeah, not the not the best Pokemon to actually uh, to actually have. I mean, Wubat is a Psychic and Flying type Pokemon, but you know, it's not much of my it's not my cup of tea if you guys know what I mean. Alrighty, so here we are going up against a Bug Trainer, and well, let's see, what do we have right here? Venipede, as always, at level 11. So here we have the man, the myth, the legend, Oikinator, doing his thing with an Ember attack. Now, I'm still waiting on that fighting type move for this Pokemon right here. It, it, it is a fighting type Pokemon now, it's just I'm kind of waiting on the fighting type move. Now, here comes a Carablast right here, so let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go straight for Zippy now that it knows Thunderstock. And, well, hopefully it actually proves to be a little bit better against this guy right here. So let's go Thunderstock for the win. Not really. And there it is, is, a Poison Sting attack. Do not want that, because, yeah, you can only have so many antidotes. And, well, here comes another Poison Sting. And, well, I'm taking the risk, guys. I am taking the whole risk. And here comes a Leer attack. Not so good, but let's go right ahead and use another Thunder Shock. Come on! Poison Sting, it's finally poisoned? No, it's not. It survived. So here it is. Thundershock for the win. Look at that. And Zippy grows to level 12. That's right. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. You got me. Yes, I did. Yes, sir. I did. Okay. So let's move on right here. Going to be uh, grabbing some items. Look at that. We found ourselves a potion. Pretty good. And, well, let's see. There must be an item item right here. And there it is. TM12, which I believe is Water Gun, I think. Let's see, let's go ahead and take a look at this. Yes, it is Water Gun, so let's see who can learn this. Obviously, Mr. Hydro, since it's our Water-type Pokemon. Not going to do anything about that, so let's just move on right here, guys. And, well, I'm only assuming... Like, uh, as, like, I'm only assuming that this Pokemon trainer has, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, an Audino. So, let's see. I kind of want to use Toxicity just for this situation right here, so... Let's see what she has. What? I'm waiting for my friends to find me here. Okay. Well, let's see what you're all about. Here we have a last wanting to battle us, and what she comes out is the Muna. So we kind of screwed ourselves a little bit because Muna is a psychic type Pokemon. But does it have a psychic type move? Let us find out. Nope. It has defense curl, so that's one. And yes, it does have a psychic type move. So let's. Yes, we are going to poison this Pokemon right here, and, well, I think we've already done our job right here by poisoning this Pokemon. So let's go ahead and switch out the Pokemon right here to something a little more, you know, a little more uh, viable for this battle. Let's go with Mr. Hydro, because, uh, again, Oinkinator. Yep, it is a Fighting-type Pokemon. Do not want to mess with that. There's the Psy Wave attack, and that one did a lot. And luckily for us, we do have a Lick attack. Psychic, Psychics are still weak against uh, whatchamacallit's, uh, yes, they are still weak against ghost type attacks right here. So let's go with the water gun. And, damn, this Muna right here is, uh, yeah, it is, uh, not, it's not giving us a chance right now. Even though, like, even though it's poisoned, it's still just wanting to, like, beat us right here. And, well, it's tanky, too, so, wow, holy crud. I did not expect that. Okay, so I did not expect Muna for just like to just come out with a freaking uh whatchamacallit, a, a Psybeam attack. So let's go with Flash right here. 
He's gonna coattail on its uh, on the the uh, on its uh, teammate's victory right here. So let's go with a bind attack. This Pokemon cannot move. Yes. Okay. So we got it in a bit of a a little bit of a cycle right here. So it can't do anything. Muna has been defeated. Toxicity grows to level 11, and Flash grows to level 11. Again, I was not expecting Muna to just throw out a Psybeam, which is ridiculous. Okay. Alright guys, so I'm gonna go back to the Pokemon Center. We need to heal up our Pokemon. I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I'm back right here. Now, something that I found out about this cave is that you can actually find a Muna for yourself. And it got me thinking that maybe I should capture one of those guys. So, let's go ahead and put Oinkinator in the front just, uh, you know, for, you know, future purposes and all that stuff. And... Or, well, let's see, let's see. Hmm. Yeah, for future references. That way, uh, we're gonna be meeting up against some Alrighty, so we're back here again. We're, we're just gonna keep on uh, continuing this whole editing right here, guys. Most of these Pokemon, not so important, but you are gonna be finding Team Rocket members right here. Look at that. We, Team Rocket, are Pokemon gangsters. You don't say. Okay, so here we go, going up against a Team Rocket member, and, well, he is coming out with a Drillbur. This right here is new, because Drillbur is a ground-type Pokemon. Let's go ahead and switch it out to Mr. Hydro right here. Now, Drillbur is a fast Pokemon, so you just got to be careful for this guy. And here comes its Scratch Attack. Now, it does have high uh, high stats on the attack right there. So, here we go. Water Gun for the win, I hope. And, yes, it does. It's a critical hit. Holy crud. Okay. All right. And, well, let's see. Patrat coming out. Let's go right ahead and go straight to Oinkinator. Oink, oink, oink. Doing his thing right here. All right, Oinkinator, you can do this. Do it for the you-know-whats, and here we go. Ember attack does its trick. Can it? No, it doesn't, and here comes a bite attack, so... Yeah, we're gonna attack him one more time. Look at that. Does its trick. Patrat has been defeated. Yes, sir, and, well, here comes a Swoobat. I got the Pokemon for you. Let's go straight to Zippy right here. And, well, let's see, let's see, let's see. Zippy... Likes long walks on the beach. Here's a Thundershock just for it. And, well, I kind of wish Dyna uh, Tynamo would learn that stuff real quick, but, you know, it is what it is for right now. And so, let's go Thundershock again. And this Woobat will not just go. And, well, wow, these guys are like, you know, telling me that maybe I should get myself in a, a Psychic type Pokemon because, yeah, we kind of do need that. And look at that, Draven has defeated the Rocket yet again. Uh, yes, sir. Defeating Pokemon. Like yes, that's my thing. Fine. Okay, let's see what we got. Okay, so here we go. Grabbing this, we found ourselves an HP up. Could be used for HP or sell it for a uh, Okay, let's see, let's see. We're walking by, we're gonna do this, and you know what? Like I said, we're gonna be using the speed button too just to get through and this. And look at that, we're back again. Okay, you can find Audinos in here, guys. Again, beating an Audino would be like 369 experience points. That's a lot right now going into this adventure. And, well, look at this. We are finding ourselves a guy that doesn't like being sneaked on. So, let's go right ahead and defeat him. Here we have... Super Nerd wants to fight, and he is coming out with his Blitzel right here. So this is something new. Okay, Blitzel. I don't like you, you don't like me, but here comes an Ember attack just to see how this works. And that nearly defeats Blitzel right there, but here comes a Tail Wag attack. And here we go again, Ember attack for the win. Say goodbye, and well, let's see. Coming out with a Joltik. Why does that name sound so familiar? Okay, let's go with Waddle, see what that what happens right here. And yes, it is a bug and electric type Pokemon. Another Pokemon that I could be using. And well, let's see. It is a bug type Pokemon, so I should have stuck with the uh, Oinkinator right here. Alrighty. Let's see what we got. Leech Life does its thing. Why do you keep on doing that to me? I don't even know. So there we go, critical hit, and well, let's go with an Ember Attack just to finish this guy off. And look at that, Joltik has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. Waddles too, getting some points. And look at this. My Pokemon won't do. No, it won't. Okay, let's find some more items right here. Grabbing this, we found ourselves another potion. And, well, let's see. Moving on forward, there's another ball right there. And we found ourselves a rare candy. Now, 
I could give it to Oinkinator and it could be at level 20, that leaving me with all these other Pokemon, but I kind of want to use Flash. Let's see. Alright, you know what? I'm probably just going to give it to Flash, mainly because I kind of wanted to to learn more moves and all that stuff. So, let's see. Let's go with the rare candy right here, Flash. There you are, level 12. And it doesn't learn anything, but it's, you know... It grows another level. That's good. Okay, so let's go ahead and put Mr. Hydro up uh, up front. Might be growing more levels right here. And look at that. We found this ball and we found an escape rope. Not bad. Not okay. Bad. You gotta hate those swoo bats. You really do. They're so god dang annoying. And she's like, wow, it's bigger in here than I thought. My bad. Okay, so here we go. Another last wants to fight and she is coming out with her cottony. This is something new right here. Okay, Cottony is looking pretty beastly, but guess what? I got Toxicity, so hopefully its Poison Sting attack would actually work right here. And, well, let's see. Here comes an Absorb attack. Doesn't do much damage. Okay, it's a pretty good thing that I have Toxicity. Let's go with the Poison Sting, and, well, Absorb is going to keep on hitting me right now. Alrighty, here we go. Poison Sting. Come on. Damn you. Okay, we're going to do a speed button right here. There we go, keep it going, keep it going, and there we go, we defeated it. And well, let's see, we got a Pedalil. I'm gonna take my chances right here with Toxicity, and keep on doing the same thing, even though it's getting leashed life and all that stuff. And well, there we go, we defeated Pedalil, and Toxicity grows to level 12, which is great. So I think I might be doing that just to just speed up battles right here, guys, because you kinda know what's going on. You kind of know what's going on, guys, and, well, yeah, you kind of know what's going on, and you, man, we need repels, we really do, like I was saying, you kind of know what's going on, guys, and, uh, you kind of want to speed it up just a tad okay, bit. Okay, so, we took on another Audino, and it messed up my, uh, Mr. Hydro right here, but Flash took over and got more experience points so that I guess it's pretty good but I think we're gonna have to like switch it up afterwards so let's go ahead and switch up to Waddles right here and well let's see we got another Team Rocket member waiting for us grab this and we found ourselves a TM01 which would be I would like to say Mega Punch could be wrong let's see Mega Punch yes I was right and well, let's see. Oinkinator can learn that, and Mr. Hydro can. So let's give that to Mr. or Oinkinator right here. Just so I can have an extra move. Alright, bring it on. We're pulling a big job here, get lost, kid. Okay. Don't necessarily care, but would like to embarrass you right here. So here we go. Another Team Rocket member going out with a Woobat. Sort of, kind of picked the wrong Pokemon right here. So let's go ahead and go with Zippy. And speed button. Here we go. Thunder shock, and that's another Pokemon down. Let's go. Let's see. Oinkinator right here. So right now, I'm kind of not doing so good, but luckily for us, we do have that Mega Punch, and that right there takes care of Wubaf. And look at that, 81 points. Waddles grows to level 11. Oinkinator does his thing, and well, here comes a Purloin. And, well, let's see, Toxicity could do something, but Flash could do something too, but I'm going to stick with Oinkinator right here, kind of hoping that it will learn a fighting type move at some point. And there we go, Purloin has been defeated. Look at that, and yes, we get some more Pokemon, uh, Poke Dollars right here, and yes, we are very good. Alright, let's grab this thing God, right here. You gotta hate Woobats! And we found ourselves an Aether, okay! So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to use the escape rope, get the heck out of here, heal my Pokemon, and get back to where I needed to be. So I'll be right back with you guys. Hey, so I'm back, guys, and I accidentally speeded through right here to this guy. So let's go right ahead and battle him. Really doesn't matter. Okay, so here we go, going up against a youngster, and he wants to come out with his Patrat. Well, I got myself Waddles right here. No problem, no biggie. Let's go with an Absorb attack, and, uh, well, let's see, let's see. Takes a nice amount of uh, HP right there. Here comes a Bite attack. And no biggie, because Absorb replenishes our HP. Like, uh, Gatorade. And, well, it's only a matter of time before somebody faints right here. So let's go with the speed button, and there we go. We're doing the same thing, and, well, 
There you go, we defeated that guy, going up against another Pat Rat. So, let's go right ahead and go straight to Oinkinator right here. Alright, Oinkinator, I don't like you, you don't like me, but guess what? We need a win, so let's go with a Mega Punch Attack for the win. And look at that, Pat Rat has been defeated. Oh yes, and here comes a Woobat, and we pick... We're gonna pick the right Pokemon for this one. Let's go with Zippy right here. Now there is one little flaw to the whole, you know, uh, speed button. You can't read ex oh, like you can't read everything that has been put right there on the screen. Sometimes you go up against a Pokemon that uses Counter or uses uh, what was it? Crud baskets. Oh crud! I got confused. Or you go up against a Pokemon that uses Bide, and well, look at that. We're getting our butts kicked right here by Woobat. Holy crud, come on! Ah! God damn you, Zippy. Alright, Flash, do your thing. Okay, so here we have Flash. Let's go with a Thunder Wave attack. There we go. We're being Strategic Magic right here. And, well, here comes a Woobat Gust. And because of that, let's go with the Bind. I used to hate... Well, I... Everybody hates the whole Bind Constrict kind of a, a thing where you're asleep and it binds you, you can't really do anything, especially if you're slow, and I guess that's the reason why Time, uh, Tynamo right here is, uh, well, has Thunder Wave and Bind, because that's the way to go. And, well, let's see, I'm not going to even heal my Pokemon right here. I think I already know, know that uh, I'm going to well, be I'm not going to I'm not going to be using uh, uh, Zippy for very long, because Tynamo is actually proven to be a very useful Pokemon. We need repels, god dang it! And look at that, we found ourselves a Moonstone. Don't know what necessarily evolves into a Moonstone. Okay. Whoa, you shocked me! Yes, we shocked you, homeboy. Okay, so here we go, going up against a Hiker, and he wants to fight, so here comes a Rog and Rolla. Okay, Rog and Rolla meet Waddles right here, and this is perfect. So let's go with the Absorb attack. Look at that. Absorb does its thing, and well, we're gonna be taking on a sand attack right here, so let's continue on right here. And we defeat that Rogarola, grow to level 12. And well, we're taking on another one, so let's continue on right here. Continue with the whole thing. And yes, Waddles is just kicking some butt. Here comes a Dweeble, so we're gonna have to switch this one out. Let's go straight to Mr. Hydro. Dweeble is a, oh wow, the equivalent of a Krabby right here, so. Yeah, buddy. Let's go with a water gun attack for the win. And there goes Dweeble, feeling so blue. And Mr. Hydro grows to level 14. Yeah, alrighty, okay, alrighty. We are strong. All right, let's get the heck out of here, okay. Hopefully no Pokemon attacks us oh, too soon. Well. Might as well just keep my mouth shut while I'm doing this, right? Probably, I don't uh, know. I hate you, Pokemon. Okay, so here we are in the last room of this whole area, and, well, there's more items to find. Not right there. <laughs> Not right there. Okay, like I said, we need repels, guys. We really do. And, well, let's see. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. I kind of want to use Flash for this one. I could be making a mistake, but let's see. Little kids should leave grown-ups alone. Alrighty, here we go, going up against a Team Rocket member, only having one Pokemon, and here's a Herdier, good gravy. This is scary, because Herdier does have a pretty good attack, and, oh, gravy, okay, so here comes a Thunder Wave attack, come on. Alright, it cannot do anything, but here we have a Crud, and just like that, takedown hits us pretty hard. That is a very powerful move coming from a Pokemon like that. So let's go ahead and go to Oinkinator. Mainly because of its fighting type capability. So let's go straight for the Mega Punch. And there. Oh, crud. Hurt your. Fully paralyzed. Thank you, Jeebus. Okay, so here we go. Mega Punch for the win. Yes. Okay, and look at that. The first member of the level 20 club. And this guy is learning smog. Okay, alrighty. Okay, so let's see. Where do we go from here? Let's take away uh, Tail Whip. We don't really need it. Look at that. Smog attack. A poison type move. And, well, at the cost of one of my Pokemon, this guy's like, I'm steamed. Yes, you are. Let's move on. I, I hate guess. these Pokemon, I, I swear to God. 
Eventually, I'm gonna capture them. Yeah, I'm gonna capture these Pokemon eventually. I don't know. We'll see. We'll eventually see right here, guys. Look at that. Moving on forward. Before we do anything, let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Flash has been fainted. So both our Electric-type Pokemon are gone. Alright, fuck. Toxicity, we, you can do it, alright? I believe in you. Okay, let's see what we got here. And here we have another Team Rocket member. Team Rocket will find the fossils and revive and sell them for cash. Okay, alrighty. Whatever you say, homeboy. So here we go, going up against a Team Rocket member. And here's a Pet Rat going up against Toxicity. Alright, let's do this. There we go. Defense curl, defense curl, and it missed. Here we go. And well, as you can see, that's a pretty boring battle that we just speed through. Here he comes with the Woobat, and I am not going to take my chances. Let's go straight to Oinkinator. And well, let's see what Oinkinator can do against this guy right here. Let's go. Ember attack for the win. And Woobat. Yeah, Woobat being Woobat. Hitting me pretty hard right there, so here we go. Ember attack again. Look at that. Woobat defeated. And yes, we defeated another Team Rocket member right there. Yes, not feeling so good right now. Okay, so let's go straight forward. Find that uh, Moonstone right here. Look at that. Free Moonstone, guys. And well, let's see. How old were you guys when you found out that there was a Moonstone right there? Comment down below. Alright, let's see. This looks like a job for Oinkinator right here, and, uh, well, let's go ahead and see what this is all about. Hey, stop! I found these fossils, and they're both mine. Well, we, we, we said this quite a few times, and, well, it's going to be the same result every single time. Here he comes out with a Trubish, a new Pokemon, and it, that, of course, is replacing Coughing. And, well, it's just telling me that we need freaking Psychic-type Pokemon, and I think I have an idea who we're going to get for this whole situation. Look at that, we defeated this guy. And well, he's gonna come out with a Joltik. That right there is another advantage for Oinkinator himself. And so, let's go with an Ember attack. And look at that, Joltik defeated. Alrighty. And well, here he comes out with another Trubish. So, I'm just gonna stick with the same man right here. Let's go straight for a Mega Punch. And look at that, Mega Punch does the thing. Say goodbye to Trubbish. Level 21 Oinkinator's kicking some butt, taking names. Look at that. Okay, alrighty. And of course, he's going to want to share. So, okay, so now knowing the Nova region, there are two different kinds of fossils the plume, the plume fossil, and the. Shoot, I forgot the other one. But I think I already know which fossil I want to use. As you can see, this is the plume fossil that will actually get uh, Arkin. And here we have the cover fossil, which will be, shoot, that, you know, Ninja Turtle looking Pokemon. But I think I already know what Pokemon I want. It's the plume fossil, so let's go ahead and grab that one. Yeah, buddy, we got the plume fossil. And this guy comes out with the cover fossil. Now, he, of course, is going to tell us that there is a, uh, there's a Pokemon leg that will revive these Pokemon. And, well, that's pretty cool, fine and dandy. Time to get the F out of here. And, well, let's see. Right there. And right there. Hallelujah, we are out of Mount Moon. Okay, so now it's time for us to get to Cerulean City right here. Now, I'm trying to figure out if there's an item right here that we haven't missed. Nope. Okay, so let's move on. See? You see this? This is freedom. This is fresh air. We don't have to deal with any of the other Pokemon right here, but look at this. We grabbed ourselves a TL04, which is Mega Kick, I would like to say. Or believe. Hold on just a sec. And we're grabbing that, and it is a whirlwind. We don't need it. Okay. Alrighty. Okay, so we're moving on right here, and I wonder what Pokemon you can actually find in this whole area right here. Stay tuned. Nah, I'm just playing, guys. I'm gonna... I'm gonna try to figure this out. Hold on just a second. Okay, never mind. The usual Pokemon, and one Pokemon in particular is Drillbur, which we've already had in Pokemon Black. Uh, unfortunately, that's not a Pokemon that I want to actually put on my team for right now. There is a Pokemon that I want. It's just we're gonna have to wait later on to go find them. So, we're here in Cerulean City. And, well, in the next episode, we're going to be taking a tour of this whole place, battling the Nugget Bridge and whatnot, and see what else this game brings to us. So, thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you guys next time.